Hi guys, welcome to my channel. So just a quick introduction, my name is Ainsley. Um, this channel is mostly going to be about mommy stuff, maybe a bit of lifestyle, fashion, beauty. Um, I don't know, I don't know yet, but definitely mommy stuff. Stuff? <laughs> but definitely mommy stuff. So as the video suggests, this is going to be about my kids' 2019 Easter basket. So I have a daughter, her name is Kairayuna, and she's two years old, two and a half years old right now. And I also have another one coming on the way. And yeah, so if I sound like I'm panting or out of breath, it's because I am currently in my fifth uh, month of pregnancy. So let's get started with what I got my daughter for um, her Easter basket. Funny thing though is I got all of this Easter basket fillers, but the one thing that I didn't I didn't get or um, don't have the one thing I don't have is the actual Easter basket. Now Pottery Barns Philippines um, suggested one basket. They have only one Easter basket in stock right now, and when I looked at it, when I saw it, I just I felt that it looked a little bit creepy so it wasn't it didn't look that cute to me so I decided to forgo that one and maybe just um, order one from um, their website their US website I guess and have it shipped here in the Philippines where I currently live so that was a long introduction um, so I realized that um, Easter baskets here in the Philippines aren't really a big thing Easter, we acknowledge Easter, but um, putting out baskets filled with presents and goodies aren't really a thing here in the Philippines. But I thought it was so cute that, and I wanted my children to grow up having, you know, traditions. So I think this would be one nice tradition for uh, my kids. And yeah, that's why I'm doing this. And it's very late, I know, but um, I had to save up. <laughs> I really wanted to do this for Kyra for this year because last year um, I only did the uh, surprise eggs which she didn't really appreciate that much. First because she was only one year old and she didn't get to eat the chocolates because I did not allow her to do so. So I was the one who ate all of the chocolates but I promised myself and her that um, I would make it up to her in the coming years. So this is actually my daughter's first Easter basket and I could not be more excited, as you can tell. So let's get on with the actual fillers that I got for my non-existent, my daughter's non-existent basket. I went to, um, I went to Rustan's department store in Makati. I went to their toy section, toy department, and I couldn't resist buying this one. This is the Scruffle Loves um, stuffed toy. And you have a choice, actually. Uh, you can just buy this box, or you can buy the box that comes with the basin. And here, a washcloth, as you can see there. Okay, so basically what's inside this is a stuffed toy that's pretty balled up. And what you do is um, you bathe it, hence the um, basin. You bathe the toy and then you blow dry it and then um, comb out his hair or her hair and then you'll get to find out what kind of pet you got. And I believe the salesman also told me that uh, it comes with a birth certificate of the pet. So I decided to get this for my daughter just maybe so that she can have a bit of, I don't know, a sense of responsibility, I guess, or maybe, you know, just to give her a bit of an experience <laughs> of what responsibility is. So this one. So I was also thinking the reason why I didn't get um, an Easter basket yet, I don't have an Easter basket yet, is first, um, I didn't really like the options that are online, uh, that are readily available here in Manila. Um, second, I thought that maybe I could just use the basin as um, uh, as an Easter basket. So I'll just open this up later and then maybe try to put <laughs> put everything inside this small basin though. I don't know how I'm gonna do that. Anyway, 
So, next thing that I got from Rustans is this Magic Kid Chan Pool Pops. It's create your own popsicle thing. And my daughter, she loves anything um, ice cold, ice cold candy, uh, ice lollies, popsicles, ice creams. So I thought maybe she'd have fun uh, making her own and eating it as well. So this is, oh by the way, if you're curious, this is 1,549.75 centavos uh, at the Rustan's Toy Department Store. Um, and then this one is 349 and 75 cents at um, Rustan's. So the next thing that I got from the toy department store at Rustan's is this Zuru Ush Putty. Putty? 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 I don't know how to pronounce it, guys. I'm sorry. So I got this one. It's like a slime here at the back, if you can see it. So it's like a slime, and I got the Blizzard one. So it's supposed to be a slime with bits of um, little snowflakes inside, you know. And Kyra, my daughter, has been into watching YouTube videos lately, and she already knows about slime. And so I think she will have fun with this one. I I vowed to myself that this is the only slime she's ever gonna get because I kind of I've been hearing a lot of moms complain at how messy it can be. So yeah, that's the only slime she's gonna get. And then I also got her this um, cake set. It's um what do you call it? It's a clay cake set. There. Because she loves making cake. She loves making anything. Um, she loves playing with sand, the kinetic sand thing. She loves um, clays. She loves painting. She's kind of artsy, actually. So I really think that she's going to love this one. And recently, she's been... She's frequently, you know, making pretend cakes and then singing happy birthday, which is really cute. So I think she will love this one. This one is 449 and 75 centavos at Rustan's. And then the last two things that I got from uh, Rustan's toy department store is <laughs> I'm sweating because there's no aircon in here. Um, if I turn on the aircon, it's going to be really loud in the background and I don't want that. So yeah, um, and it's summer now here in the Philippines. So pardon my sweat beads that's probably coming down my face. Anyway, so I got two of this surprise. No, no, no. <laughs> I got two of these Fairyland cuties. And it's like that. I watched the, I watched um, an unboxing or unwrapping of this on YouTube before deciding to get this. Um, I didn't want to get her a lot of those surprise thingies just because, I don't know, they're a lot of... They, they use a lot of plastics and I'm trying to cut down on my um, plastic usage if that makes sense to you guys. So anyway, I just got her two of this because I really think it's cute and she enjoys, uh, you know, stuff like this. So I relented. I got her two of this. By the way, these are on sale. So from 399 and 75 centavos, they are now only 200 pesos each. So not bad. Yeah, I think she's going to have fun unwrapping those. And then I went, of course, to National Bookstore. And as I've mentioned, uh, my daughter is kind of artsy. She loves painting. She loves coloring. She loves making stuff from her sands and clays. So I got her this drawing book from National Bookstore where she can paint and draw. And I can just have them all inside, you know, one notebook or one pad and not have it all scattered about. That's great. And then I also, she's recently into Barbies. She she just recently started liking Barbies, which is fun for me because um, growing up, I loved Barbies. I absolutely adored Barbies. So I got her this coloring book, this Barbie coloring book. It's a Barbie Girls World coloring book. And this was only 129 and 75 centavos from National Bookstore. This one was... 54 and 75 centavos. So not bad, not bad. And then one last thing I got from National Bookstore is this um, non-toxic bubbles uh, bubble set. And it's 50 it was 54 pesos and my daughter loves my daughter adores 
bubbles. So I really think she's gonna enjoy this one. I also went to Mother Care and I got her this swimsuit, which I really like. I don't know what you call this uh, type of fabric or whatever, sear sucker, I think? I'm not sure. And it has ruffles uh, in the front and then at the back. It has ruffles on the straps like that. And it's really, really cute. Um, I've, I had my eye on this ever since I first saw it last week. And when I went back, of course, last week I didn't have money. And when I went back uh, yesterday for this, um, they only had the age three to four years available. And then two more that are like um, for ages, I think, six and above. Anyway, so this was selling out fast. So I just decided to get her the um, three to four years, which is the only one they have here. So I think she'll fit in here anyway. She's a tall girl. She's a tall toddler. Okay, this one was 1,199 pesos from Mother Care. And then also from Mother Care, I just could not resist. I got her this nail polish. Okay, so it's a nail polish that can be rubbed off or washed off. And this is 420 pesos. So yeah <laughs> i don't think i'm gonna buy any more of this until she gets a little bit more you know a little bit older because this is to me this is expensive i'm sorry <laughs> this isn't something that i would buy frequently for her uh, this is just a one-time thing plus her dad is not really keen on her um playing with makeup at this at such a young age and you know it doesn't matter. I, I feel the same way. So I'm just letting her have fun with this one. So yeah, 420 for a kid's nail polish is pretty, it's kind of expensive to me. Also from Mother Care, I got her this Skip Hop water bottle and it's 295 pesos. Um, this is probably her fifth water bottle because it just keeps breaking or she keeps losing, you know, um, parts of her water bottle that's why I keep on buying them and then I got her some ribbons from uh, Instagram so this one is from Pink Fleur Fairy and I did not really expect it to be this big uh, my daughter has thin hair like me and <laughs> I don't know how this is going to look on her hair I thought this was gonna be pretty small but I'm gonna we're gonna make it work there you go they're so adorable. I love them. I really do. So I got my daughter another set of um, ribbon clips or bow clips. And these two were from Two Little Lions. There. You can see. I don't know. Can you see? There. So this, this two are from Two Little Lions. Okay. I'm getting really tired and it's really hot. So the last... Thing that I'm gonna show you well not really the last thing but second to the last is this um, like I said earlier my daughter is starting to really like Barbies and she even requested or you know she keeps asking me about mermaid Barbie and she has one already but it was the toy that came with um the happy meal from McDonald's and so she has that but I wanted to get her a bigger one you know the actual Barbie toy and I got her this one, and this is the Sparkle Lights Mermaid. If you can see it. There. And what's so great about this that I think she would enjoy tremendously is, you know, the light. There. There you go. And at the back, it's like that. So this one was 1,799 and 75 pesos and I got this from Aldi and Co. This is the plastic. If you're not familiar with the store. So Aldi and Co. And then one more thing I got my daughter, one last thing I got her because I just could not resist are a pair of mini Melissa's. I'm just gonna show you, if I cannot show you um, on the video itself, I'm just gonna show you here on my phone. But I got her this one. The, the one in pink is what I got her. I just do not know if it will arrive before Holy Week. 
So hopefully it does. But I forgot, I also got her a set of pajamas, bunny pajamas that I think she will love. And I'll try to show it to you here on the phone if I cannot show it on the screen. It's this rabbit pink baby kids girl pajama set, Terno, from Kids Forever. I got this one from Shopee, but I know that they have they also have an Instagram shop. So I'm going to also link that down in the description box below. Hopefully, this also arrives before Holy Week. Anyway, that is everything. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. And I hope you will subscribe and tune in to my future videos. And yeah, hopefully I get to vlog regularly now. Uh, I keep saying that, but I never really do. Let's see. Thank you guys for watching again and goodbye. Okay, so now let's try to um, put them all in this um, basin or tub. This is going to be my daughter's Easter basket. I'm just going to tear that off. Oh my, I don't think it's <laughs> I don't think it's going to fit. Oh no, I don't think everything's going to fit. It's not going to fit. Oh my. Yeah, no, I don't think everything's going to fit. I'm making it work. <laughs> Make it work. It's not working. <laughs> it's not working. Oh, I forgot to take out the prices, but she's not gonna mind anyway. She can't read yet. So, yeah. There. Put here. And stuff here. Guys, I'm proud of myself. I made it work. I'm just going to show you a photo of it. So I actually managed to make it work. Uh, wasn't easy, but it works.